Did you know workers once glowed in the dark because their jobs were literally killing them? In 1888, 14-year-old Annie Bell started work at Bryant and May Match Factory in London. For 12 hours daily, she dipped wooden sticks into white phosphorus paste. The factory churned out millions of matches, but the phosphorus vapor was deadly. It started with simple toothaches, then came the bone death they called Fossy Jaw. Annie's jaw began rotting away piece by piece, chunks of infected bone falling from her mouth. But she kept working. She needed the money to survive. Entire sections of her face collapsed inward as phosphorus ate through the bones. Gaping holes appeared where her cheek once was. The worst part? Green pus oozed from workers' faces, glowing so bright you could spot victims in complete darkness. Annie's entire lower jaw eventually disintegrated and had to be surgically removed. The factory owners knew phosphorus was lethal, but profits mattered more than lives. Over 1,000 match workers died before safer alternatives were finally mandated.